even get to Ross. Hey everyone, how's it going? I have a how-to tutorial for you guys today, and it's centered around animations and characters, and how to get free animations and characters. So now, if you came straight from my Unity Basic tutorial series, or you have no idea what I'm talking about when I refer to characters and animations in Unity, um, then this is going to be confusing. For those who understand animation, how to import them, and etc., then this video will help you. So, so I'm going to show off some of the animations for the zombie and the character I've also gotten um, from this website, which I'm about to show you. So, we're going to play this, and I'm going to show some of it off here. Actually, we do want to maximize on screen here. So, here's the walking. It's a little bit speeded up, but... And then, there's the death animation. So th those are just two, and I'm going to show you the uh, the run. One second here, okay. That's the run. This is the idle. Okay, you already saw the death. This is the attack. And that's all I have here. So, but those are just some of the animations that you can get. This looks nice, I know, it looks awesome. But to get these animations, you will need to make an account on Mixamo. I think I think it's how you pronounce it. But you can sign up for a free account. Of course, you will have limited amount of animations. The website will be in the description, of course. And so once you create an account, it, it should have somewhere around on the home page to sign up. It's free for a free account. There's a free account. So once you sign up, go to the store right here. As you can see, there's anim awesome packs for you to download. These are animation packs, I'm pretty sure. And once you've found an animation pack that you like, you can customize it and rename it. So we're going to pick this one. And so customizing it. So here, here you go. These are just some previews of them. So customize it by doing that. And then delete them by pressing that trash can next to the animation that you want to delete. And you're so as I said, you're limited on how many you can get, so you're not going to be able to get a whole pack. So that's the downside. But you can get a few. Rename it. You just go right here, and you can rename it. So, um, Dominator. There you go. So you rename it, and you can change the character by going here, and go to make some out characters, and here you go. All right. So this is a different character, and once you have a um enough animations and once you once you like your pack click add cart add to cart and this will come up if you don't if you don't if you can't download as many as you have here once it's downloaded you go to my assets you go to my animations and then you should have it here so this is the zombie one I'm pretty sure it's this one yeah so you click on it and then you press Q download once you press Q download, you go to downloads right here, and then it should appear here. And you can remove it right there, and then start download, I think, shows up. And you start it, downloads, good as that, simple. And this is the zip file that I got from, this is a zombie one that I imported. So you simply just drag and drop them in, and it's good as good as that. And then put them in a folder, and it comes in with a folder, I'm, I'm pretty sure. And... There you go. You got it all. You can use it with the mechanism system here, and yeah, there you go. So as simple as that. Quick, easy, free, and all the stuff that you guys want. And that's that's it for this video. So I hope that helped you guys. And make sure to subscribe by clicking the button right somewhere on the screen, actually, by, by somewhere on the screen. By doing this, you will know when I upload, and you will support me. So yeah. So stay awesome guys, peace.